Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Creative Careers and if you are new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button because I make contents regarding all kinds of creative field, architecture, interior design, graphic design, UX, UI design, doing your business design like web design and uh, entrepreneur design like uh, enterprise design I mean. Then you have service system design. So if you want to know about all these fields, how to join the colleges for this or how to do it with, without going to the college or anything react, relating that, please hit that subscribe button. And today's video is specially for uh, NATA aspirants who are preparing for NATA third attempt. And this is on elements of architecture without wasting time. Let's begin. And if you haven't my, uh, watched my older video on NATA uh, preparation, please go and check out my playlist. Uh, uh, there is a playlist called as uh, NATA, NATA third attempt 2021 exam and uh, you watch all the videos which are present there including this one. So let's begin. The first one is uh, the point point or dot it remarks a uh, end or a mo one of the prominent part in the video okay so uh, uh, so you have to uh, in most importantly we see this uh, feature in the uh, tower tops or uh, when it's the color show of our temples you you see it from very far right there will be a end point or even the words topmost building has that uh, top point right so these points define one of the topmost points or and in certain elements columns acts as a point because each column when you draw in a plan shaped uh, 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 sorry when you draw it in a plan it will be a uh, it will be a point okay so when this point moves from one place to another place that path becomes the line so this path can be said as edge of the different to elements like when it's if it's a wall its edge is a line or when uh, lines are continuously repeated when repetition is occurs in the line it makes a certain kind of textures so remember uh, joining the uh, design element and a principle uh, design principle uh, architectural element and a principle we get the results so here we are repeating we are getting a texture so this is how design works that's what i was telling for solving plan based question you understand these elements you understand design principles you understand architectural ordering principles and see what what all we can you can get it from that right so the this is about line okay then there is plane plane is your floor your all the walls it can be in different shape uh the the shape of your plane uh, is can be any plane okay so every edge of this plane there is a line right when you continuously move a line in a certain direction it becomes a plane when you rotate uh, uh when okay so when you uh, when you when when your line goes round it will be a circular plane or an elliptical plane so that's that's how the design changes and we see planes everywhere right in our windows to doors they all define a plane then you have volume e all these different planes when they combine uh, with respective of num uh, their direction and all they form a volume that is either most of the uh, people you might be sitting in a cube room right or uh, sorry like cuboid cube or a cuboid then uh, these shapes give a form to the building so every building has certain form there can be uh, cylindrical forms there can be uh, or these cuboidal forms are very common then you have various forms forms of these uh, buildings like sydney opera house they define very variant structure right so then there are way too many forms with the experimentations in the modern days buildings right which which will express you the uh, volumes in it so these are the things you have to look in a building so this was a very short video done for uh, elements of architecture and if you haven't watched the older video please watch them and if you're new to my channel or if you haven't subscribed the channel yet please go and hit the subscribe button and please go and check out the channel for all different sort of information regarding creative fields. Thank you.